Baltimore Sports. We're here with Coach Wolf after their kickoff classic victory over Episcopal. Coach, um, you had some strong words for for your team. Uh, talk about uh, uh, what was behind those those words and motivating them uh, tonight. I, I still think we got a good football team. I, I think we had a lot of first game jitters today. Uh, you know, we got the first time the O lines played together as a unit. There's a whole bunch of new pieces there. Uh, some guys that were JV football players last year. QB, uh, it's his first time taking snaps for us. We're, we're still trying to find out who our running back is. We know we got some good receivers. We still, I mean, we dropped some balls tonight. I thought we played great on defense. Uh, I mean, our de our defensive line is special with uh, you know Tucker Cody and uh, BJ Carter and and our middle linebacker Austin Cruz. I feel like that guy can play anywhere. DBs look good tonight. Uh, sophomore phenom that we got uh, Vaughn Lane. T.J. Lane's little brother, our running back last year, had a pick six, so it was good for him. Like I said, I, I thought we played really good on defense. Uh, you know, we, if it wasn't for that uh, sideline penalty, like we had him off the field and when, when we, we pitched a shutout. So, I don't know. I feel like we played good on defense. We still got a long ways to go on offense, though. So. The holes were there. Uh, um, you could see that the line was really uh, pushing the defensive line back. Uh, what are you excited about with your offensive line? Uh I'm excited about getting to work with them on Monday. Like I know we got some some work we got to to, to do. We got I feel like there was some things, some blitzes and stuff that we didn't pick up as good as I thought we should have. Uh, I thought our, our our second running back that came in, Kendrick O'Neill, played really good. I think I think I think we might have found out who our back is, which is good. That allows us to move Jaden Boyd. You know he's a Division One DB, so it allows us to move him to play a little DB. So uh, fullback played great. Travis McStevenson. Uh, so we just got a few things we got to clean up up front. I thought, I thought we played okay, I, but it's just a little sloppy. But I guess you're, that's going to happen, you know, in a first game in a preseason classic. It showed tonight that you have, I mean, playmakers. I mean, the speed uh, took it to the house on offense, took it to the house on uh, defense. That's got to be a good feeling to uh, know that you got. Uh, Playmakers that can change the game at any time. Yeah, we do. We got we got some speed on the perimeter with with Aiden Worthy and Braden Street and, and Jabo Jenkins and Jaron Rozier. Like um, we got some threats on the outside for sure. We just we got to shore some things up front so we can so the QB's got a little time to get a ball to them. All right, Coach. Congratulations on the victory. Uh, good luck this season and uh, uh, great work always of, of what you're doing here at Middlebury. Appreciate you guys and everything you do for high school sports. Thank you, Coach.